Hello my friends, welcome back in another episode of Lords of Blades. Most of you know, in Japanese culture, a katana sword. But there are much more types. And that's exactly what we're gonna show you with Master Jakub today. So, let's get started. So, for example, Master Jakub, uh, can you tell us which sword is the most oldest in our list? I suppose that the uh, oldest kind of uh, Japanese sword is uh, this kind of touchy sword. Uh, you know katana, may I ask? Mm -hmm. uh, katana is worn uh, like this, with a blade upstairs. But, uh, tachi is older kind of sword and it's worn uh, like this. Ah. Edge uh, to the earth. Uh, so, uh, this kind of touchy sword uh, comes from a Han period, it's from 8th to 12th uh, century. And uh, it's typical uh, for Japanese wool because it's folded steel with Hamon tempering line mm -hmm. and it's different uh, from other kinds of swords which we should find in uh, China or Korea. This kind of sword uh, has been called uh, Chokuto and uh, wear with straight blade and uh, with handle only for one hand uh, fencing. For Japanese sword it's typical to uh, do fencing mostly with two hands as well, in case of long sword, of course. Can you explain why they changed the angle after some period? Yes, uh, it was a uh, changing of fighting strategy. Uh, Tachi was a primary weapon for cavalry. Uh, uh, samurai were in the first period mostly mounted uh, archer and uh, for uh, for cavalry were better this kind uh, of sword uh, but uh, in uh, Muromachi period uh, in middle Muromachi period in the 15th century uh, infantry uh, or big uh, armies of Ashigaru uh, lower ranking samurai increased uh, and uh, for infantry is better katana because uh, we should do uh, so-called nuki uchi or uh, uh, cut immediately after drawing of sword. Mm, and it was more difficult with this type? Uh, yes, it mm -hmm. was not so easy. Mm -hmm. uh, for example, in time when I were running, it, it was Ah, moving, moving, moving like side. this. But this one uh, stay more. So samurai uh, need one hand uh, to catch handle. Uh, ah. uh, in mm -hmm. maybe you know uh, Genko Shurai Ekotoba, uh, very famous uh, paintings from Mongolian invasion uh, in 13th, 13th century. So all running samurai have to handle uh, tsuka or handle of ah. the sword like this. Uh -huh. but so they basically have to use both hands. Yes, or? yes. But in case of katana, it's very stable under the obi or belt, mm -hmm. and I should uh, move freely, and uh, I should uh, use uh, different weapon, uh, for example, uh, spare or yari, mm -hmm. uh, hinawaju or uh, matlog gun, uh, etc. So, you know, in big changes of strategy, a big change of uh, using sword. Uh, also a pair. Very interesting. Mm -hmm. uh, usually we should hear that uh, Tachi is uh, used together with armor and uh, katana in uh, normal everyday samurai dress. And Master Jakub, I can see that you have also another Tachi on the table. Can you explain what's like the difference? Yes. Of course uh, uh, Tachi was uh, primarily uh, fighting weapons, but uh, after that it become also ceremonial weapon. This one is not so uh, old. Koshire of this sword, uh, Koshire means fitting, is from a Meiji period, uh, from end of uh, 19th century, but it's very good copy uh, of uh, uh, ceremonial sword. Here is, for example, Aoimon, it's a uh, family chest of uh, Shogun ah. Tokugawa, Tokugawa family. Mm. So. 
when uh, katana in uh, 15th century appeared, it doesn't mean that uh, uh, tachi disappeared. Uh, tachi has been made uh, uh, until uh, Edo period uh, in the uh, end of 19th century. Uh, but uh, of course, it's much more katana than tachi in uh, collections. Second thing, look at that. This looks very exotic and I would have no idea from the shape that that would be something Japanese. So, can you explain? So, in the fact, uh, Japanese world is uh, very deeply uh, connected with uh, Japanese culture. Uh, for example, here we should see Meiji period copy of Edo period uh, ceremonial sword. So it was not only weapon, it should be, for example, the status explaining ceremonial yeah, item. Ceremony. And uh, uh, this uh, small sword or tanto is in the fact not weapon, it's Mamori Mono. Uh, inside is sharp blade, mamori but mono. Mamori Mono means something like talisman. Uh, it's, in a, it's in a shape of fox, because uh, white fox is a kamitsukai or messenger of Inarisama, it's a uh, Shinto god of uh, some profession, for example, swordsmiths, uh, geishas, uh, or uh, etc. So uh, this was not weapon, but it was something uh, like a magical uh, instrument. Mm -hmm. And this would be maybe displayed in the house? Or? Yes, yes, yes. Ah, For example, okay. uh, in Butsudan of home altar. And next items, we have this bamboo sword and the wooden sword. What are those? Yes, uh, this sword is copy of Bokuto or wooden sword uh, in which uh, uh, Miyamoto Musashi, or very famous swords, uh, swordsman of start of 17th century, win uh, fight against uh, Sasaki Kojiro in uh, Ganyujima Island. So Musashi made uh, wooden sword, sword like this and uh, win uh, this dead duel with Sasaki Kojiro. Uh, usually, wooden sword was uh, used uh, for practicing of uh, fencing or kenjutsu, uh, but uh, you have. Uh, Bam bamboo sword uh, called mm -hmm. Chikuto or Shinai. <coughs> First time uh, Yagyu Shinkageryu uh, made bamboo sword uh, called uh, Hikihada Shinai in the uh, end of 16th and start of 17th century. But uh, this kind of uh, bamboo sword is used in Japanese uh, fencing called Kendo. Ah, and can I ask, is there some reason why it's like this uh, strapping on the... Uh, yes, it's very important uh, question. Uh, in case of Japanese sword, we have to cut uh, with, with blade. So uh, in case ah. of wrong angle, uh, cut shouldn't uh, be uh, successful. Uh -huh. So we have to explain which part is the blade. So for this reason, this string it's like an imaginary is necessary. Blade. Mm -hmm. Yes, yes, yes. Very interesting. So this one is more used just for the practice and this one you would use maybe in the combat scenario or... It was used, used for practice as well, but uh, ah. Miyamoto Musashi was very famous uh, for uh, using it in a true duel ah, all with right. a very uh, strong opponent. Alright, I think let's move to something bigger and sharper. Yes. And this sword is a lot bigger. Can you explain why the length and what it is? Yes, it's called uh, Nagamaki. This uh, kind of halberd uh, has been used uh, from a hand period for, uh, from uh, 8th century to about uh, 14th century. It was Neubrov Naginata, maybe you know Japanese ah. halberd called Naginata. Uh -huh. And you was able to see it in episodes 10 Samurai Weapons. So if you haven't seen it, definitely check it out. But what it is? Yes, uh, Nagamaki -o is older kind of uh, Naginata. For example, this kind of Naginata uh, has been used from uh, the middle Muromachi period or 15th century, but uh, this is uh, used from uh, Han period or 8th century. Of course, uh, Nagamaki has been used even uh, 
uh, in the later periods, but uh, was quite rare, not typical uh, kind of Japanese sword. It's made uh, with same technology like uh, swords like katana. It's with temper line or hamon and mm -hmm. uh, cut very well. And was there any reason for such a long handle? Uh, because uh, you should. Uh, uh, do some hakaeshi or mochikae in case of uh, uh, cutting. Uh, you should change position of hands in the handle ah. in time of fighting. Uh -huh. But with the uh, Naginata, you have basically more reach compared to this one, right? Yes. This kind is uh, light Naginata called Menaginata. Uh, it was used uh, by women. Much more heavy uh, Naginata was a uh, men's weapon, uh, of course. And we definitely have to mention classic katana. And we have even this one from, you told me, 14th century or something like yes, that? Yes, Nambukucho period, but oh, wow. this is not masterpiece. Uh, it's Suryage Mumei, a sword f uh, from uh, Nambukucho period. Uh, and uh, this sword uh, has been shortened. It, it was uh, primary tachi, uh, this sword, and after that uh, uh, has been uh, shortened ah, to katana. Uh -huh. Usually uh, tachi is a little bit longer than katana, and uh, especially from uh, Muromachi period or 15th, 16th century. In uh, yes. Mm. Mm. It's uh, odambira, mm. uh, typical for Nambukucho period. Uh, Odampira means uh, flat uh, uh, blade. Quite heavy. With okisaki or big tip. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So uh, it's one Japanese proverb uh, katana, warezu magarazu yoku kireru. It means uh, Japanese word uh, uh, don't break, don't bend, and cut well. So usually. Uh, it's tested on bamboo or straw mats uh, called tatami omote. Uh, maybe you re remember or previous uh, uh, part about kabuto warrior cutting of a helmet. Uh, so definitely uh, Japanese sword uh, cut very very well. But uh, Japanese sword is not only a weapon. Some Japanese proverb tell that uh, katana wa bushi no tamashi uh, or uh, Japanese sword is soul of samurai or, mm -hmm. or katana wa bushi no kikotsu uh, it's uh, with the uh, same meaning. And can you please explain to many people because if you give to somebody that doesn't know you give them katana a lot of people tend to touch the blade so can you explain uh, why you very, very shouldn't good, touch? Uh, very good uh, question uh, because uh, Japanese uh, sword is very sharp, you should cut your finger, of course. Mm. But uh, uh, in old Japan, uh, touching of blade of sword is very, very r rude. It's very unpolite because uh, it's called uh, katana, no fu uh, katana no fumenboku or katana no yogoshi. Uh, in old Japan, uh, it was maintained that uh, blade of uh, sword reflect the human's soul. Mm -hmm. So please don't touch a uh, blade of swords <laughs> if you are visiting some uh, Japanese yes. uh, friends. And of course corrosion, right? And, and of course co corrosion. By the way, polishing of one uh, finger of blade uh, cost about uh, uh, 10,000 uh, Japanese yen. Hmm. So it's quite expensive in case of uh, good Polish or Jotogi. Uh, Master Jakub, you also told me that katana was sometimes used in some scenarios for throwing. Is it true? Yes, it's true. Uh, mostly short sword or wakizashi, but also katana has been used uh, like uchimono. Uh, so it was using uh, long sword as shuriken. Ah, maybe we can try. Do you have some special sword for it? You want to see it, guys? Come check it out. What it is one in the wooden sheet? Yes. 
It's uh, called Shirasaya. Uh, you should see it in some uh, Yakuza movies. But uh, Shirasaya is uh, uh, Magnolia Wood uh, case for Blade. If Blade is not in Koshirae or fitting like this. If I will remove this uh, pin, bamboo pin called Mekugi, I should see Nakago or Tank of Blade. I should uh, ah. see signature of a sword. Okay. In this case, it's uh, Nagahiro uh, from Bungo Takara school from the middle Muromachi period in the 15th century. Uh, what is this uh, setup? Yes, it's a Japanese water cleaning set. For example, this is Uchiko powder. It's uh, made from uh, sword polishing stone Uchigumori and it is for blade cleaning. You should use this maybe after the every time you're gonna be cutting or something like that? Yes, yes. You're gonna be using the sword? Or if somebody touch the blade <laughs> of your sword. <laughs> Don't touch it guys, you know it already. So in this case you have uh, uh, remove his uh, blood from the <laughs> <laughs> blade. <laughs> and what it is, Jakub? It's like some short katana or...? Uh, it's called wakizashi or kodachi. Uh, for example, tanto uh, or the jury is uh, with a blade of length to uh, 30 centimeters. From 30 to 60 centimeters it's wakizashi or kodachi and uh, longer than uh, 60 centimeters or nishaku amari in the old uh, Japanese is called katana or tachi. Uh, for example, it was right for samurai used taisho. Taisho means long and, uh, long and uh, short and it is katana and wakizashi, for example, in uh, Edo period in uh, last uh, 300 years, in previous period. Uh, Daisho should be Tanto or Tachi. And uh, uh, only samurai ha had the right to uh, use uh, long sword or katana, and uh, uh, farmer, nomin, uh, or uh, commoners, chonin, should use for self defense only this short sword or mm. bakizashi. There are some style uh, uh, using. Uh, Nitoryu or uh, long and uh, short sword uh, together. Of course, most famous is Nitenichiryu uh, style uh, made uh, by Miyamoto Musashi, a very famous uh, swordsmith of uh, start of uh, Edo period in the uh, 17th century. He was using both hands, right? Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. uh, usually, uh, Wakizashi were in uh, left hand and Katana in uh, right one. Wow. Next one uh, is Ken Sword called uh, Shikomi Katana. Maybe you know uh, Zatoichi movie. Uh, so Zatoichi used uh, this Ken Sword as well. It was, of course, uh, not only used in uh, old Japan, but in uh, uh, Europe, China, etc. So it looked like usually uh, uh, Ken mm -hmm. uh, for walking, but of course. It is some uh, blade inside. Ah. Uh, usually it's short sword or uh, wakizashi blade, uh, but uh, in case like this, this is a contemporary reproduction, is a uh, long or katana blade inside uh, this uh, koshirai or fitting. Yes. And it was used mainly by the older people or with some disabilities? Uh, or? For example, it, it uh, was a uh, kakushi buki or hidden uh, weapon for some traveling spies, etc. But ah. most of uh, Shikumi Katana is from the uh, end of 19th uh, century, for, uh, from the uh, start of Meiji period. Uh, in the uh, uh, 70s of 19th century, samurai lost uh, right to use uh, Daisho or Power of Swords and uh, was very uncomfortable with it. So. Uh, often used Shikomi Gatana for uh, self-protection. Uh, Next one I don't see on the table. Where yes, it is? It's here and it's uh, Tanto. Uh, Tanto is short sword. Uh, 
uh, length of the blade is about from 20 to 30 centimeters and uh, was used in uh, some cases. For example, Yoroido Shitanto was a Japanese misericordia with a very strong blade which should stab uh, through the uh, Japanese armor or Yoroi. Yeah. And, uh, uh, Tanto should be used for self-protection. There are two ways how to handle Tanto. One is called Honte and second one is uh, uh, Gyakute. should be used for blocking, uh, uh, for example. And uh, of course, uh, same like uh, Katana or Wakizashi, Tanto should be used like Uchimono or uh, mostly no spin shuriken. So ah. you should try. Uh, yeah, because you told it, me there was one famous story with the throwing of the. Yes, bike. yes, yes. It's a very famous duel between uh, Miyamoto Musashi and Shishido Baiken, very famous master of Kusarigama or ah. chain uh, cyclists. Uh -huh. So um, Musashi won this duel by throwing, by throwing of uh, his short sword. Maybe I should show you guys. Come on. is something much more bigger than the katana. Look at that. What is the name? It's called uh, Nodachi or Odachi or Seoidachi. It's a uh, giant sword for two hands. Uh, we should wow. compare the length of this uh, sword. Uh, length of this sword should be about two meters uh, for a blade. Uh, there are two ways uh, how to use uh, Nodachi, it, it uh, has been used especially in the Mokucho period in the uh, 14th century. In battles, it was used for uh, horse leg cutting. Uh, cutting the legs or but, something? Uh, yes, but what was used not only by infantry but uh, also in uh, cavalry. And the uh, second reason why to make uh, uh, so long sword was for uh, religion purposes, uh, it has been called. Uh, Honoto, it, it was a votive gift for uh, Otera or Jinja or uh, Buddhist or Shinto shrine. So this giant sword, in this case, were not weapon uh, but some uh, instrument of religion which show power of goodness. So. Mm, wow, it's really huge. In famous duel in the uh, year uh, 1612, uh, Miyamoto Musashi used uh, Bokuto against uh, Nodachi uh, of called Monohoshi Zao, uh, which were sword made by uh, Bizen Nagamitsu, and uh, uh, this sword uh, was weapon of uh, Musashi's opponent uh, Sasaki Kojiro. But uh, Musashi won despite the uh, length of this sword. So only big size is uh, automatically not uh, advantage in uh, all <laughs> cases. So as you were able to see today guys, there is much more sword than just the katana. So big thanks to Master Jakub and Hakuzan Dojo for great demonstration. And of course, definitely check out the older episodes of Lords of Blades. But for today, that's it. So thank you one for watching. Share, like, comment, subscribe, and Sarabaja. see you next time. <laughs>